A very short review for the Blackview 9900 Pro uh, Thermal by FLIR. Um, you know, a very desired phone for uh, a lot of working men. Um, you know, they've been researching this phone. Uh, you can use it for, uh, you know, whether you're a plumber, um, electrician, um, a demo expert, um, multiple multiple uses, multiple uses. Uh, say you're an AC guy, you're trying to look for, for um, some heat or AC escaping from the house, right? Perfect phone for this. Um, now, the main reason for this video is because um, it's for my U.S. friends, okay? It's for, it's for the USA mostly because there's a lot of controversy saying, that, hey, this phone doesn't work in the U.S., oh, you only get 2G, you only get 3G, you don't get any signal at all. Um, you know, there's a lot of, a lot of arguments on the internet going on, um, but I want to let you know that uh, it's working, okay? AT&T with full bars, 4G LTE. Okay, super, super fast, everything, no, no problems whatsoever. I mean, the, the phone is, uh, the phone works flawlessly, okay? Um, you know, loads, loads quick, really quick, right? No problem. Saves your pages and reopens them quick, right where you left off. Um, the main reason people want this phone, um, it's for the thermal camera, which is, Pretty freaking crazy if you ask me uh, and you know you got a heartbeat sensor right here too um, and then some other sensors here on the side where is it I don't know where they are but you got other readers on here you can measure a bunch of different things um, but I guess I'll show the thermal right quick since that's what's the most desired thing about this phone so I'm gonna call my dog over here, Crowder. Come here, bud. Hey. Oh, he's right there. You don't even wanna. You don't wanna move. So if you can see on the phone, picks him up pretty well. Pretty well. And I mean, the the stuff is so. I mean, this this is. I'll show you how how quick it works. Okay. I'm gonna put my hand here for. Uh, that's it. That's it. That's what I'm put it there for. Look at that. Isn't that, isn't that spectacular? So it works in the U.S. Okay. The things that I saw the controversy surrounding really <clears throat> was service providers. Okay. Now, if you have AT and T, this is gonna work. Okay, you have no problems. You can't get it to work when you get it. Guess what you do? You just call at and tech support and they will set it up for you. That's what I do. Okay. Um, I wouldn't try to go about it yourself if you are that technically inclined. I mean, you know, do it so at your own risk. Um, but what I can tell you is that Verizon and Sprint seem to be having the issues. And that's where these arguments are coming from. It seems they don't have the proper bands for this phone. They don't provide those bands. Uh, but AT&T does. Um, Cricket. Cricket uses the same bands as AT&T. Um, there's a couple more. I don't know. You just got to look. Just Google it. Look what what providers have the same, share the same bands as uh, good old AT&T here. Um, but yeah, guys, it works in the United States. And uh, the, phone is a, the phone is a piece of technology that no one has in their pocket normally. So. Uh, I highly recommend this phone, um, and I'll post another video in the future to update you whether it poops out or it's a solid, long-term good phone. Have a good one, guys. See you.